Konnichiwa everybody, welcome to part 3 of Shohei Otani Rookie Cards, or in 2013 BBM Baseball Sets. Hey everybody, thanks again for tuning in to part 3 of this series. This is going to be a 12 part series. And as you saw in part one, I did a quick overview of the 11 different BBM sets in 2013 that contained Shohei Otani rookie cards. In part two, I did a highlight video of the 18 cards that are in his 2013 BBM rookie edition. And here in this part three, I'm going to highlight the eight different cards that you can get in his 2013 BBM Icons Hope set. And you can see the Icons Hope set there, uh, at least the box art off to the right of the screen here. Now this set is unique, it was a boxed set, and so it contained 27 regular cards and then one special insert card, and I'll highlight each one of those. This set was limited to 3,000 cards, or 3,000 sets, and so I'll break that down into each of the subsets. Okay, so again, this is a boxed set, so you are guaranteed um, all of the 27 base cards in each of the different sets. So this is card number 14, this is Shohei Otani's base card here uh, in this set. You can see that it is Pitching Pose. So you can see up in the right hand corner, 2013 BBM, and then the set name down at the bottom, Icons Hope. Now Icons is a, is a yearly release, and so they have different names uh, of Icons. Um, in 2013, again, this was called Icons Hope. And here is the back of this um, Icons Hope base card number 14. Uh, it contains his uh, his number at the top, his name, some vital statistics. Uh, again, it says rookie in the middle, and then a little bit uh, of, of his background there in the middle, written in Japanese. Okay, and then Shohei Otani's other base card in this set is called Michinoku Express. This is card number 26, and you can see that here uh, on the front. Um, Yusue Kikuchi on the left, and then Shohei Otani on the right. Not quite sure of the relationship between the two, uh, but they did capture that here on this card. And then if you look on the back, here are the, the two players, Otani on the left um, and Kikuchi on the right, with uh, some, some Japanese written below. And then you can see vital statistics or on the biographical statistics there in the middle. And again, this set was limited to just 3,000 editions, so there's only 3,000 of these cards out there. Okay, the first randomly insert special card that you could get of Shohei Otani is this die cut class of 1994 insert. Now this was the gold foil version and these were numbered to 90 and you can see that uh, gold number 94 there and then the icons that is all gold foil and you can see the die cut outline there and again these were numbered to 90. Okay there's another version of this die cut card. Um, this is the red foil version and this is only numbered to 40 and again this uh, highlights two pictures here that you can see Shintaro Fujinami and Shohei Otani both uh, that were born in the year 1994 and they were both captured on this special insert die cut. Now these were again randomly inserted into the 3000 um, Icons Hope uh, boxed sets. One thing I didn't mention before is the back number is DC06 and we can see that here on the next shot. Okay, and here's the back shot of that previous red foiled version. You can see in the upper, upper left-hand corner, it's numbered out of 40. And, and then you can see that die cut a little bit better here in this shot. Now, I didn't have a great picture of this. This is a really hard um, insert to get. This is the blue foiled version of this class of 1994 special insert. And again, you can see the blue foil on both the 1994 and then at the bottom icons and then icons hope class of 94. And again, this is number DC06, but this is the blue foil parallel and only numbered out of 20. Okay, the second special insert that you could get in these box set of Shohei Otani is this gold foil facsimile auto version uh, of his signature. And you saw this again in, in his rookie edition. Uh, BBM liked to use these facsimile gold foil, silver foil, red foil, blue foil, different versions of his card as chase parallels. And so you can see this, uh, this gold, uh, the gold foil printed here. And at the bottom it says printed autographed card. So again, not a real autograph, but a printed autograph. And these are numbered PA14 in the set. So printed autograph 14. 
And you can see here on the back, uh, these special gold foil autos were numbered out of 50 with that PA14 at the bottom. Now I don't have a picture of it, but there's also a hollow foil version of this and uh, the printed autograph is actually this holographic sparkle pattern. And these were only numbered to 20. Uh, and again, those are really hard to find. I could not find an image of that, but, uh, but that, that is another version. Okay, and then the huge chase card out of this. This is Shohei Otani's first ever actual autographed card um, in 2013. So this is the authentic autographed card, only numbered out of 10. Now, this is a screenshot. These are sticker autos. You can see that there in the middle, a little bit of the outline. But that these were randomly inserted into the box sets. Uh, again, only numbered to 10, so these were extremely hard pulls. Um, there's no names on the back of them, um, but you can see that there, that's Shohei Otani's signature. Uh, and then this is what it would look like if you were to pull one of those. So this is, again, his very first rookie autograph card, and that comes in this Icons Hope set. Okay, and so here's just a quick highlight of part three. Again, we talked about the eight different cards that you can get in this BBM Icons Hope set. Uh, and coupled with the 18 cards that you could get in his Rookie Edition, we are now up to 26 different cards that you can get um, so far. In the part four, we will talk uh, BBM first version, and this has his very popular Wing Rookie card, so we'll talk through all that uh, in the next video. Sayonara everybody, thanks again for tuning in. Have a great one.